Hello everybody, it's Gary Stuckey with Real Music. Well, it's been a year since the passing of Sinead O'Connor, and back in January I did a video about the cause of death was ruled, and it said natural causes. And now, uh, recently, uh, there was a post in People Magazine uh, talking about her death, and it was explained officially what happened Uh and this is coming from the Irish Independent, and uh, it cited that the Grammy winner's death certificate stated that she died from chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and asthma. And the certificate specifically said that O'Connor's death was a result of exacerbation of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and bronchial asthma together with low-grade lower respiratory tract infection, according to the outlet. And, you know, that's, that's sad news, uh, but it explains uh, some things and maybe puts to rest some things. Um, you know, a very tormented life uh, for such a talented lady, of course. I love her for the song Nothing Compares to You. Of course, she had other hits and other albums and uh, was a very outspoken lady. She stood up for what she believed in. You know, you didn't have to believe in everything that she uh, believed in, but the fact that she was strong and she didn't back down, you know, and a lot of times, uh, you know, like the instance where she was booed on stage, uh, you know, when Chris Christopherson came up and, uh, and, and took up for, her, you know, and, but she stood strong and, you know, didn't, uh, she didn't back down from what she believed in, you know, and, uh, you, you put that with talent, you put that with uh, the ability uh, to reach people. You know, you're reaching people through music and in your life. And she was, she was, uh, she was a talented lady, but tormented through uh, emotional uh, issues. You know, uh, physical. Uh, she had problems uh, in her f personal life. You know, um, different things uh, that really haunted her throughout her life, and. Uh, it had an impact on her, um, but she still kept going. You know, her fans were always uh, appreciative of her, and I know they still hold her in high regards. And it's been a year, but they're still uh, loving her music and loving who she was. But rest in peace, Sinead O'Connor. With Real Music, I'm Gary Stuckey. Always remember to keep the music real.